Hi, I'm Raf, and in this video, we're going to be solving the sponsorships quest from level three. In this quest, you're going to have to sponsor the creation of an account with a zero balance. It's important to note in this quest, there's two ways of solving it. Uh, one is if you've clicked the fun button, which I don't recommend. And if you haven't, it's much easier. Otherwise, it becomes really abstract in, in, this, in its explanation. So don't click the fun button just yet. If you have, head over to the second half of this video where I'll explain to you how you can solve this quest. So on Stellar, you need to lock up um, some of your XLM. It's called a base reserve when you do certain actions. So sub entries, for example, like trust lines, buy sell offers, uh, additional signers, these require you to lock up 0.5 XLM. When you create an account, you need to lock up two base reserves, so one XLM. And when you do a ledger entry, like creating a claimant or making a claimable balance, you need to lock up 0.5 XLM. Kind of looks like this. Uh, I have an account here that has, I've created it with one XLM, but zero are available because one XLM is set as a base reserve. This prevents kind of spamming or malicious behavior on the network. In this quest, we're gonna create an account that has zero XLM and none of it is locked up. The reason why none of it is locked up is because that base reserve is sponsored by another account. This account has locked up some XLM for the creation of the others. So um, let's head over to the Stellar Quest and let's go and copy our Quest Key Pair and let's get this solved. Don't click on Fund. There you go. Okay. Now let's head over to the Stellar Lab and let's go generate another key pair. Uh, copy over my public key. And I'm gonna copy over my secret key. And let's go and fund this one. This is the one that's gonna be locking up the, uh, the XLM for the creation of the other account. Hey, give me a sec here, okay. So what, you can't sponsor an account, another account in perpetuity on the network. It has to be built kind of in like in a transaction sandwich where you start sponsoring, you create the account, and then you end the sponsorship. And it's important to note also that um, the account that's being sponsored needs to agree to the sponsorship and the ending of the sponsorship. So afterwards, at the end of this, we're gonna sign it with both the secret key of the sponsor account and the quest wallet. So the one that's going to be creating this transaction is our sponsor account. Let's go copy that. Let's go fetch our next sequence number. Okay, we're gonna go create uh, an operation. Again, starting our sandwich. And in here, I'm gonna go uh, begin sponsoring future reserves. And the reserve that we're gonna be sponsoring is of the quest wallet. Okay, and then let's go add an operation. And then inside of our sandwich, we're creating a create account. The account that we are creating again is our quest wallet. And it's important to set our starting balance as zero to solve this quest. Um, and then now let's go add an operation. And let's go end sponsoring future reserves. And the source account has to be set to the Quest Wallet. The Quest Wallet has to agree to the sponsorship and ending the sponsorship. Okay, let's go sign in transaction signer and let's go add both our secret keys. And let's go submit in transaction signer and then submit it to the network. If we head over to Stellar Expert, we should see an account that was created with zero XLM and zero set as the base reserve. So let's go and check it. Copy over my public key. I'm gonna go to Stellar Expert. I'm gonna pop, pop, put it in here. And there we go. We can see an account with zero XLM and zero in reserve. And the reason why there's zero in reserve is because it's being sponsored and paid for by another account. Another account has that XLM that's been locked up and for you or for the other account. You can see down here, the operations that were used. I hope that helped. 
in the second half of this video, we're going to be solving if you already clicked on the fun button at the start. If you already clicked on the fun button, FriendBot has created the account for you with 10,000 XLM and one that's locked up as a base reserve. The goal of this quest was to create a zero balance account that is sponsored by someone else. So we're going to have to transfer this locked up asset to another account and that's going to sponsor our, uh, our account. And then we're going to have to get rid of our 10,000 XLM to someone else so that we have zero in this account. So we have zero account with zero locked up. So let's go ahead and do that. The first thing we're gonna to need to do is we're gonna to need to create a sponsorship account or an account that's gonna be sponsoring us. So let's generate the key pair and let's go and fund it. Okay, and then I'm gonna copy over my public key and my secret key. There we go. I've already documented my Quest Wallet. Um, sorry if I skipped a step. Let's go and uh, build a transaction. So uh, the source account is gonna be our sponsor account. Let's go fetch our next sequence number. And we're gonna do the same thing that we did before is we need to create a like a sandwich in our operations where we begin the sponsorship and then we're going to end the sponsorship. Between it, we're gonna get it to do what we want. So here, we're gonna begin sponsoring future reserves. The uh, account that we're sponsoring for is our Quest Wallet that already has, it's already been created. Uh, the source account is our sponsorship account. So we're just gonna leave it. Okay, let's go add an operation. And our operation is going to be this revoke sponsorship. And this one's kind of funky because we need to revoke our own self sponsorship. Right now, we are the ones that are paying that one XLM. We need to revoke that. And we are the one that's sponsoring it and we're also the ones that it's sponsored. So. Uh, the first one is what account are we revoking sponsorship for? Well, that's our Quest Wallet. And which one is ending the sponsoring? That's also our Quest Wallet. Let's go add an operation. And again, we're gonna end the sandwich here and we're gonna go end sponsoring future reserves. And then our source account is our Quest Wallet. It is the one that's agreeing to the start and the end of the sponsorship. Okay, and now let's go and, uh, whoa, 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 we forgot to do one thing here. We need to get rid of all of our XLM and make sure that we have zero in this account. So let's go and create a payment. And the payment is going to be to our sponsor account for all of our XLM. And the source account, be careful, This the one that we're setting from is the Quest Wallet. All right, let's go and sign this in the transaction submitter and let's go add both our secret keys. There we go. And let's sign in transaction submitter and submit it to the network. Hey, so if we go grab our Quest Wallet we look it up on Stellar Experts. We have a zero wallet and there's nothing locked up in it. So we kind of respond to the criteria of Stellar Quest. So let's go back, let's go verify. And there you go. Sponsorship Quest is solved. Hope that helped.